What is up guys, it's Soulbash and guess what, it's update time. All servers maintenance is announced, the servers are going down currently, it's 10.51pm my time, so servers will be down in an hour and 9 minutes, and they will be down for, let's see, roughly 5 hours, and all of them are going, going to be going down around the same time concurrently depending on the time zone but they all will be updated and i did not know that it was going to be more than this i've been quite busy and haven't got to talk to people quite as much but let's take a look uh we got christmas pictures that are going to be uh added in decorations ui of course they're going to stick with the holiday theme uh the glorious warriors warrior leap is now going to look more awesome they buff the effect to the Panda Priest Shaman Acumen skill as well. Now, three guilds can now join the Relic Rumble. Now, that is going to be very interesting. I can't wait to try that out. I uh, should be getting into a new guild tonight. And we'll be going over some more stuff with them. Uh, new scrolling message after League Champion activates double rewards, Christmas events. Of course, these events, the Christmas events, they're going to be very similar to like the Halloween event, the Thanksgiving wheel. Hopefully that thing is going to be left in, but updated to Christmas UI. Now, there are a lot of other goodies like two skill slots added to Awakening and Exalt, respectively, of course, at level 85 and 90. There are a lot of you that are already way past that, so enjoy that extra might you're gonna get from those two extra things it's gonna be interesting to see what it changes uh let's see we got new avatar modifications on the functions uh players now choose smart mode or auto mode that right there is what i'm guessing they're changing to the autoplay feature where you have the option to where if it's going to actually use the skills or if you're going to autoplay and use the skills yourself like it has been in the past. Um, new social button on the character page. Uh, they did a lot of tweaks and improvements uh, up the max level of refinements. When your character reaches 85, you can now refine to level 10. 9 was the maximum before and I believe it was 4,000 refinement stones to go to 9. So I can only guess that it's going to cost 8,000 refinement stones to go to level 10. Now, all of you guys out there that thought you were maxed on your wings, happy and content with it, guess what? You're not. Hopefully you have those ascension stones saved up because guess what? Level 7 is here. They're going to be going up. You have to have fortification level 175 to ascend those wings to level 7 though. And let's see, we have Citadel has been reduced by 20%. The HP on the tower and they also removed Builder's Damage Reduction Circle, which that is cool because that kind of irked me a little bit in that Citadel video when I was just smashing the guy inside of that circle and he basically just killed me. And let's see, Resurrection Time is reduced to five seconds in Citadel. Uh, Skeleton King, Nemesis, and Nami can now be enhanced. Uh, they fixed the bug when VIP level changes and doesn't show on the interface. Uh, bidding cooldown bugs, that was fixed. The boss and fanatics feast is not so ridiculously difficult anymore. And they fixed the transformation bug. Hopefully that'll help out in that. Uh, that video, we should be doing that this coming weekend, hopefully. Uh, let's see what else we did. Uh, they fixed the bug where the interface didn't redirect players properly after you get a cohort. Uh, activity quest change. The senior cohorts get double activity points when taking two junior cohorts to team instances, Battlefield, Battle Royal, and Relic Lord. I have a video on that coming out very soon as well. The Guild Bazaar refresh problem has been fixed. And wow, that's a lot of stuff and just a last minute update from not knowing things. Um, what do you guys think about this update what do you think is going to change as far as the gameplay you know is it going to help as far as pve is it going to help as far as pvp what are your opinions on that leave those comments in the comment section below and as always let's see 
Thanksgiving goodies, it's steep. It has not updated yet, but hopefully this thing right here is gonna get left in. This is a awesome feature to the game. Gives everybody a chance to get those wings. And got a few bonuses that I can pick up. Of course, server has reset for me already. And we've got a couple digs, gonna grab these real quick. Um, also wanna talk to you uh, we got some new stuff coming up that I'm gonna be doing, so get ready for that. Uh, I'm gonna be collabing with some guys that are actually local to where I live now. Uh, stay tuned for that. It's gonna be probably quite a few vlog types, and there's no telling what kind of crazy stuff we are gonna get into. We're also gonna be doing some gaming and some live streaming with them. So I will leave you some links when we start to do that, so stay tuned for that. Um, like I said, guys, any questions, comments, feel free to leave them in the comment section below. I'll try my best to get to them as quick as I can. And as always, like, comment, and subscribe. I am Soulbash. You guys have a nice day.